Hello everyone, and welcome to my Sister Wise official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Since the day she entered the Brown family, Robin Brown has been viewed as the villain of Sister Wise. Viewers accused her of being the main reason Cody's other three marriages didn't work. Moreover, the celeb's penchant to play the victim card also didn't sit well with her fans, and she earned contempt for her persona. But now it appears that the network has also absorbed Robin's nasty persona. This is because viewers just observed the franchise trying to paint her as the villain of the program. She was in black, and some of the specifics of her appearance were undoubtedly an eyebrow raiser for the audience. What is this all about? Sister Wives, why is Robin Brown wearing black in the official poster? Sister Wives season 19 has captivated its audience to their seats. They are watching it with their popcorn buckets since it is full with drama controversies. Amid all this, some Redditors recently asked if the network was attempting to tell them something with its official poster. It featured Robin and Cody in black, while Christine, Janelle, and Mary were in white. Robin and Cody had a darker, more villainous look than Christine, Janelle, and Mary. They had a subtle and smug appearance, while prior wives' cheeks and eyes were lively. Viewers were quick to detect the symbolism and concluded that the network had dubbed the couple the antagonist of the show. The Wicked Always Wear Black View slash O'Kill 10307 in Sister Wives. A Reddit thread even commented on how Cody and Robin appeared to be the bad guys of the Browns. Moreover, the poster clearly contrasted the two groups. A user even added, to me shows editor say she was NEVER part of the group. Another one agreed that this wasn't only a billboard, but it was a statement that was nicely constructed to depict the current dynamics. Sister Wives, Season 19 is the final season of the franchise. Sister Wives Season 19 has covered practically every important incident of the Brown family. It will depict Garrison Brown's death and how the entire family was traumatized because of it. Moreover, Janelle and Mary would also walk away from Cody, and the latter would find it hard to live with his newfound monogamous dynamics. But that's not all. Fans will observe Cody's icy demeanor towards Mary, and he will express his sorrow for marrying her. Then comes Janelle, who would force the Browns to pay the Coyote Pass land off and make things clear. On the contrary, Christine is embracing her new dating life with David Woolley and is relishing every moment of it. After viewing all of this, people feel that season 19 is the last season of the franchise. It would finally handle all the difficulties, and everything would end. Janelle, Christine, and Mary would have their individual lives, while Robin and Cody would manage their marriage. Hence, there would be no reason why the network would consider renewing the show for another season. Yet fans are waiting for the franchise to confirm the same. Robin Brown needs what others have. On Reddit, Sister Wise followers bring up that Robin Brown always is looking at what other people have. First stating, Robin always wants what everyone else has. Then adds, Robin says in the trailer she feels like an idiot for staying. I think the fact is, she is driven completely by envy, not actually love for Cody, and she has a hard time ever being pleased with what she has. She saw three women that had a lovely family, and she believed she could come in and have what they had and be Queen B. Furthermore, the user says, now the OG3 are off on trips, moving and by all accounts doing way, way better after leaving that dysfunctional environment. Well, now she wants it too. I almost wonder how badly she wanted Cody versus how much she just wanted to one-up these women for the rest of their lives. And now she can't and it's driving her mad. ETA, the passing of Garrison is not something that was positive, but I am talking about her impression of things at the time this was filmed. Maybe she's changed since then. Fans discuss Robin Brown needing what the other wives have. In response, one sister wise fan puts up a perfect analogy of how Robin Brown handled Mary, Janelle, and Christine in the plural marriage. You can't have more than one queen bee in the hive. It won't work if there are two. 
That's why two ladies shouldn't live together, since someone wants the oranges in the fridge and the other one thinks you should leave them on the counter. Personally, I enjoy cold oranges, so I put them in the fridge. Why not compromise and put them in both places? Robin was a side salad when she linked up with Cody. Then she married into the family and, instead of adding the salad to the plate, she kept herself segregated, to always be the side salad, to always be the honeymoon house. So she just made it flawless and obeyed. That's why Cody would always compliment Robin in front of Janelle or say this is how it's done at Robin's house or Robin is very awesome. Orange stealing. But the initial orange theory poster goes much further with a parallel about Robin Brown wanting what the other wives had. Robin Brown herself accused the OG women of wanting her apple while they had oranges. It seems now Robin wants her ex-sister wise oranges. Thanks I think Robin finds himself locked in a full marriage she thought she desired, while deep down it was about reigning over the family. Being the one to tell the kids and wives what the plan is, what she and Cody settled on, and she had the ultimate word on where the oranges went. She's no longer receiving her narcissistic fix lording over the husbands or kids. She's also jealous she's not in the ex-wives club and it makes her feel like the fool who got left behind because she always needs it to be about Cody and her. Robin Brown wanted Christine's orange. However, some fans elaborate on the orange parallel that Robin herself made in season 17, part 3 of the explosive tell-all. She informed Suki that the other wives couldn't compare what she and Cody had because they all had something distinct. She then stated it's like having an apple and they want your orange since you are not content with your apple. Undeniably, they believe that Robin wanted Christine's orange. While she didn't naturally gravitate to Christine, many think she wanted to be everything that Christine was and more. My belief from day one has been that she wanted to be Christine but without putting in the work. She wanted to be the sad gem that all the kids liked. Her worst error was when she started making demands on the family customs. She definitely screwed up by bringing in someone to raise her baby, not the old G3. Her expectations were wrong thus she started to monopolize everything and reinvent history. Another user adds, don't forget she elbowed her way past Christine to try to be the plague splainer. Even though her only qualifications was child a side piece, she adopted everyone else's oranges. Furthermore, they point out how Robin Brown utilized a position to become a greater Christine. Likewise, they identify ways she imitates the other wives. She either was chosen by the five to be the public speaker, or she made sure she'd be quicker than Christine to answer questions. I guess she sought to grab this role from Christine, well knowing that Christine was in a way already a public figure. I haven't done a deeper dive into this, investigating, but this is what I've caught so far. If someone has further info, please fill in. Yep, Christine was single white female on national television. Actually, she did that to Mary too. Down to the highlights and the outfits. She's creepy. Another commenter wants Robin Brown to understand. Someone should remind Robin that she has an apple. She shouldn't be comparing her apple to the other wife orange. Robin is the woman most of us hate. The one that wants what every other woman has so she can prove that she's the better woman and she can take your life from you. Once she has it, she doesn't want it anymore. She must destroy to feel good about herself, but it never lasts. What do you think of Robin Brown wanting what Christine Brown had? Do you think that is on point for what was happening in the plural family? Do you think Robin and Cody can be happy with each other? Drop your comments below. Thanks for watching if you like this video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and don't miss any updates.